So Nellie Orr, while she's working for Fusion GPS, who's being paid by the Clinton campaign and the Democrat National Committee, while she's working for that entity, is forwarding that information that she's compiling to the Justice Department. Not just to her husband, but to three other people at the Justice Department. Right. And the information is about Donald Trump. And this is all happening at the same time that the FBI and the Justice Department have started an investigation into whether the Trump campaign was in any way working with Russia to impact the election. So that's what makes it so troubling uh, and, and of such, such great concern. So can we expect her to be referred uh, criminally as, as Congressman Meadows was talking about? Mark is working on that. We're, mm -hmm. uh, I think he's working to finalize that. And we'll see mm -hmm. if, that, if that happens. Do you think Glenn, Glenn, Glenn Simpson falls into that category too? I think Jerry Nadler sent uh, letters to 81 different entities, 60 some different people, and it was interesting, two names he left off the list. Mm -hmm. Christopher Steele, the guy who puts the dossier together, and Glenn Simpson, the guy who's already come in front of Congress and said, oh, take the fifth, I'm not gonna answer questions. So wh why don't the Democrats wanna know from that guy, Glenn mm -hmm. Simpson, who employed Nellie Orr, who was a guy who was paid by the Clintons through the law firm Perkins Coie, who hired a foreigner, Christopher Steele, who put the dossier together, which we know was the basis and the reason that they were able to get the FISA warrant on Carter Page in the first place.